try it too if you can. Pretty good at this. You guys are working way too hard. You're always looking to one up us, aren't you? Seriously cool temple. Yeah, points for Ivor, I guess. This was a good tip. Well, Jesse? So, are we doing this? I think Jesse's just taking it all in. Order of the stone, let's get some treasure. Treasure! So much for treasure. This cupboard is bare. Come on, you know how these places work. The treasure's never just out in the open. Let's fan out and search the place. This is cool. Knew you'd find it. What do you think Ivor knew about this place? Eh, who knows? That guy's read like a million books and traveled all over the world. You'd probably start to learn a thing or two about a thing or two. Thoughts on this place? I think I'd rather be in a straight fight than doing all this switch pulling stuff. But I'm glad Ivor's intel about this place was good. So, how are you feeling lately? Wither sickness free, I think. Now I'm just trying to get used to having teammates and people who worry about me. That's pretty new for me. It's nice though. Okay, I'm gonna keep trying to solve this. Hey, Olivia. Yeah? So, have you been having a good time hunting for treasure? If you had asked me a couple of months ago, I would never have thought I would like all this adventuring and treasure hunting stuff. But this has actually been a really good time. And I've been getting lots of great stuff to build with. So, what kind of treasure do you hope we find in here? Well, I've been working on a build that could use another couple dispensers. But some cocoa beans would be cool, too. Any ideas for how to fix this? Well, these channels of lava are blocked in strategic locations by those sticky pistons. Unblock them, and I'm guessing something cool will happen. Okay, I'm gonna figure this out. Never doubted you for a minute. Blocked again! Axel, what you need, buddy? Axel, what do you think of the situation? Um, I don't know about the situation. I kind of do more blowing stuff up. So, if you need someone to do stuff like that, I'm totally your guy. Man, we have the best adventures, don't we? Yeah, it's pretty sweet. I was worried I wouldn't be cool enough, or smart enough, or whatever enough to be in the Order of the Stone. Thanks for always believing in me, buddy. You know it. So, what kind of loot you think we're gonna find in here? Oh, man, well, I want to make a room with an emerald floor, right? Well, who doesn't? I'm like four emeralds away, so getting some emeralds would be pretty sweet. Okay, I'm gonna keep working on this. Sounds good, dude.
would have been disappointed if the floor didn't open up into a dark, creepy passageway. This kind of reminds me of when we first found the Order's temple. We were such a scared bunch of noobs back then. Hey, I wasn't scared. Wow, yeah, that feels like it was, I don't know, a million years ago. You packed a lot in since then. And to think, that was just the beginning. Yeah, and that was before we'd fought weirder storms, hung out with Enderin, reunited the Order. So crazy. enchantment on flint and steel before but that's not unbreaking you could give it a shot and find out okay flint and steel do your thing well i have definitely never seen flint and steel do that before uh-oh Let's get you out of here. I tell you guys, doing that never gets old. Woo! Yeah, not too bad. Killing a bunch of monsters, getting sweet treasure. Like that flint and steel thing? You gotta try it again. I'd be curious to see it again, too. I'm dying to know how it works. Way ahead of you on that one, Axel. Whoa, whoa. Well, well. Where'd you
Where'd you get the new toy? <laughs> Looks a little, uh, sophisticated for you, Jesse. Order of the losers. Yeah, losers. Ugh, who let you guys out of your cave? Joke's on you, we don't live in a cave. Well, well, well. If it isn't Aiden and the Pussycats. That's not our name. So what are you, Ocelot, doing here anyway? The Ocelots were Lucas's gang. We ditched that name just like we ditched him. Yeah, we rebranded. We're the Blaze Rods now. Blaze Rods! Shut up, Gil. Sorry, boss. Wow, you guys are terrible at naming. That's a dumb name. <laughs> Says the heroes that just called their group the New Order of the Stone. And where's Lucas, huh? The minute the Order decided you were cool... For whatever reason... He wouldn't stop sniffing around you like a tame dog. You take that back! No. Hey, Lucas is ten times the guy you are. Yeah, Lucas is a hero, which is more than I can say for any of you creeps. You probably think that thing makes you so special. Classic Jesse. You take all the best stuff and never give anyone else a chance. That should have been ours. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Place rods. Oh, come on. That's not fair, Aiden. We're adventuring just like anyone else. <laughs> well, that's, that's just what I expect from someone as small-minded as you, Jesse. Hand over the flint and steel, Jesse. Don't make me ask again. You don't get that one. It's supposed to be mine. Haven't you taken enough? You better back off, Aiden. Getting this was no cakewalk. Taking you down wouldn't be any trouble at all. Big talk. Gonna back that up? I'm tired of listening to your jaw flap. Ah! You don't touch me! <gasps> Some hero you are, Jesse. Don't start something you can't finish, Aiden. I've taken on way bigger threats than you. What hope do we have when heroes like you are throwing your weight around like this? It's not always going to be this way, though. Come on, you guys. Let's get out of here. Blaze Rod! Ooh. I told you to shut up! Look out, Jesse. I don't remember him being that angry before. Wow, us being the new Order of the Stone is really getting to that guy. He's gone crazy. We should be careful. He seems different, scarier. Man, and all because he wanted that flint and steel. What are you gonna do with it? Ivor's the one that told us about this temple. He might know something about it. Whatever it is, it's powerful, and I'm gonna figure out what it does. Finally starting to recognize stuff again. Feels good to almost be home. Cheers to that, friend. I just can't shake what Aiden was saying about us back there. We do get a lot of treasure. And I guess sometimes we might throw our weight around. What? No. Aiden's got a bad case of treasure envy, pure and simple. I don't know. Come on, Aiden's just jealous. Isn't that obvious? He sees us with our fancy armor, cool treasure, and he wishes he had it too. I guess so. What Aiden thinks, there's one thing I know. What's that? They think we're awesome. They're back! You guys, they're back! Run! Tell everyone that our heroes have returned! <laughs> yep, New Order of the Stone is back in town.
isn't a happy to see us scream. Wow, that's new. It somehow manages to evoke skulls and tentacles while still doing the whole barfing lava thing. Yeesh. Talk about eyesores. That thing's hideous. Yeah, if beauty's in the eyes of the beholder, that's one beholder with serious eye problems. Not my fault! Look out! Oh, oh, help! Oh, stop your whining! What are your pathetic injuries in comparison to my majestic tower? Ivor? <sighs> of course. Oh, Jesse, you're back! Don't listen to a word these fools tell you! It's a fire hazard! And your face is an ugly hazard! So I suppose we're even. Causing trouble again? Nothing. Just a little spirited debate with the local community. Brain function is proving difficult for them. You need to remove this now! Jesse, all I wanted was what any man wants. A little house of my own. With loads of lava pouring off it. Ivor, I know you mean well, but your house wants to kill people. Dude, you made a killer house. Exactly! Killer! Shut up! What about just moving it someplace else? I'm sure... Move it? Way more lava is going to spill out if we do that. Well, we have to tear it down. We can't let that monstrosity stand. It's my house, Jesse. I have just as much a right to build something as all these people, don't I? They're just jealous that I've got vision. Well, they've got... They've got... Community planning. Blech. Sorry, Ivor, but your house is way too much of a hazard to the community. Tear it down, everyone. Good call. Ah, it's a slippery slope, Jesse. Today the lava house. Tomorrow, who knows what kind of rules you'll be imposing. Don't be a sore loser, Ivor. <laughs> Haven't seen you around in a while. So what can I do for you? Ivor, we found something in that temple you told us about. What? You did? <laughs> yes, great to see you again. Let's do lunch. I'll bring the carrots. There's no telling who's listening. Meet me in the treasure room. Ten minutes. And bring the thing you found! We're gonna tear this down. We better start getting some buckets together to scoop up all the lava. You got any iron? Oh man, no. I'm all out. <sighs> okay. We better go mine some more. We'll catch up with you later. Yeah, once we give this majestic house the funeral it deserves. Right. What he said. Sounds good. I'll see you guys soon. Later, guys. Come on, let's go find Ivor. This is really shaping up. Whoa! Lucas! I don't believe it! Oh, hey guys! You have some pretty cool stuff in here. Crazy stuff. <laughs> yeah, no doubt. It's been ages. Where were you? Oh, you know, just helping to rebuild and stuff. Weather storm left a big mess out there. Yeah, a lot of homes got wrecked. That's really good of you to help out like that. And you have so many other treasures. Boy, you've sure been busy. Oh, wow. You framed it. I'm him. Yeah. How are you doing? I still feel guilty about it. Every time I see another pig, all I can think about is how Reuben died because I put him in danger. He didn't die in some accident, Jesse. He sacrificed himself. He was a hero. Yeah, doesn't make me feel any less guilty, though. <sighs> okay, guys. I promise I wasn't just here to bum everybody out. I actually came back because I need to tell you something. It's about this weird run-in I had with Aiden. Oh, I hate that guy. Whatever you said or did, it really got to him. Man, he's such a jerk. 
I mean, he never stops. He's just been so jealous of you and the rest of the Order ever since you saved the world from the Witherstorm. He's convinced that he was supposed to be a hero. Ever since he took over the Ocelot and the Blaze Rods, it just seems like he's gotten meaner. He's pushing Maya and Gil around. Aiden's a stupid bully. He doesn't scare me. Yeah, that's what I used to say too. But he's been freaking me out lately. He got super aggressive. He demanded to know what treasure you were after next. So what'd you find that got Aiden so excited anyway? Check it out. Wow. What a weird glow. Yeah, I know. I'm supposed to show it to... You found it! No! Dude, what's wrong with you? This is the greatest find of our time. I can't believe you're actually... So how'd you know where it was? Endless research into the cracks in reality. The artifacts that shape and bend the rules as we know them. Uh, what? That glow, that enchantment, is the work of a very old group of builders. A group so old that they existed even before the Order of the Stone. Whoa. Yeah. Dramatic. Wow, so that temple we went to, was that built by these old builders? That's my suspicion. But it's what's inside the temple that interests me even more. You see, if these builders truly existed, and if you found their temple, that means we're one step closer to finding the Eversource. What a beautiful sight. Looks like you came back just in time, Lucas. Did you just make that up? No, I found books, mysterious tomes, referencing it on my travels. Mysterious tomes, huh? The Eversource is said to be an object of incredible power possessed by the old builders. It was some sort of treasure or artifact that gave them an endless supply of precious materials. Think about it, Jesse. That temple must have been its hiding place. Wow. Old builders? You learn something new every day. I'm still just trying to wrap my head around the Eversource. Well, what are we waiting for, then? We've already been to that temple once. Finding it again will be a snap. Old builders, Eversources, ancient mysteries? You know I'm in. Excellent! I'll pack my adventuring things immediately. Wait, he's coming? Wow, sounds like you guys have a lot to get to. I, uh, guess I'll take off? Nope, you're coming with. I need a buffer between me and Ivor. Let's get moving. This is so exciting. <laughs> Adventure! Lucas, I know it's daytime, but watch our backs, okay? I can't believe we're bringing Ivor with us. I mean, it's nice that he's so excited, but, oh, not my top choice for adventuring companion. Hey, you can't argue that when it comes to all this ancient history and treasure, Ivor knows a lot. Sure, that's true. These trees are enormous! I love it so much! He just really gets on my nerves sometimes. Remarkable. Look at this architecture. So old. So exquisite. Oh, this is just how I dreamed it would be. Except for less cake. My dreams usually involve cake. Hey, let's not get all enamored with the architecture now. We've got a treasure to find. Wow, it looks so different during the day. Okay, but careful what you touch. There could be traps everywhere. Petra, long guy. Are you two as excited as I am? I'm not sure that's possible. Huh. Doesn't look like those lava channels work anymore. I can't believe we missed some sort of secret area here last night. Uh. We were kind of fighting, oh, a ton of monsters. It's not surprising that we didn't hit every single nook and cranny. You look excited, Ivor. Excited? I'm ecstatic. Thrilled. Overjoyed. The Eversource could finally be within my grasp. Once, sir. Uh, once we find it, that is.
Pretty cool temple, right? Yeah, it's amazing. Not gonna lie to you, Jesse, I'm pretty excited to be along for the ride on this one. Well, that wasn't there last night. That looks promising. I'm heading up. Fantastic! We'll follow right behind you! Uh, yeah. What he said. So, you think this Eversource thing is up here? Hard to say, Jesse. As the story goes, the old builders feared its potential. So they hid it away in a place where it would never be found. And ha! It never has been! Well, that seems what promising. What is Jesse doing up there? Jesse! What do you see? <gasps> Some kind of portal? It's just as I'd imagined. Spectacular. Ivor, I was just thinking, maybe that treasure... The Eversource. Yeah, that. Maybe those old dudes hid it in a portal. Hiding something in a portal. I like it. That makes a lot of sense. Here goes nothing. Oh, thanks for bringing this back to me, Jesse. I knew you were good for something. You're pretty easy to follow, you know that? That thing is way bigger and more powerful than you can understand, Aiden. Give it back. Says the person who just got knocked trying to light it. Step aside, Jesse. We're heading through that portal now. Oh, no way! Aiden, you're done. This is where it ends. Fine. Blaze rods! Clear me a path. See that? What? So very strange. Wow. Looks like some kind of city. That's incredible. That's it. That's where it must be. The Eversource. A city in the clouds. It almost sounds impossible. I just don't know how we're going to reach it. Yeah, that's definitely going to be a problem. I can't believe this. We fall through a portal into another world, and then we can't even go anywhere. If solutions were powered by complaints, we'd already be there thanks to you. But they're not. Maybe a bridge instead. I don't know. 
Seems like a long way. Do we have enough blocks? I mean, it's really, really far. Yes, very astute, Lucas. Ivor the Grump strikes again, I see. Elementary, my dear Lucas. The underside of this island is much, much bigger than it appears. Really? Jesse's right. If we strip this whole island down to nothing, it might just be enough. Stop pushing! I'm not pushing! Lucas is pushing! I'm just trying to keep away from the edge! It's all edge! Okay, gang, I think that should do it. Let's make ourselves a bridge. Excellent! This is our stop. Everybody off. Ivor, seriously? This is in memory of my lava house. Long live lava! You're building. I, you, I, I, I don't. Hey there, love what you did with your town. Yeah, it's very flashy. You helped build it? Y you, 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 you were building. Uh, unauthorized building is against the law. Wait, there's a law saying people can't build? Yes, it's forbidden. This, this makes no sense. No sense. Okay, I'll bite. Why is building against the law? Oh, uh, th this is making me terribly nervous. But uh, first, those other outsiders, now you. Other outsiders? Where are uh, they? Uh, uh, they went to the inn. I I'm sorry, but that's all I know. Wait, wait, wait. Come I'm back. I'm super busy. Sorry. And he's gone. <sighs> Darn. I wonder if everyone here is that nervous. <laughs> wow. Incredible. It's unbelievable who made it. Whoever it was must have had the Eversource. It's the only explanation for the copious amount of rare materials they used to build it. And when I get my hands on it... Hey, how about you take a massive chill pill and we find it first? Yes, 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 yes! I'm just getting excited. And as crazy as Aiden's been lately, if he gets that thing, it would be bad. Well, if we beat him to it... He won't be able to get his slimy little hands on the thing. We need to find Aiden. He's got our flint and steel, and he's up to no good, but we're gonna stop him. He mentioned an inn, right? That seems like our best lead for finding Aiden so far. Agreed. The blaze rods already have a head start, so we need to get moving. We don't have any time to lose. Hello! It is nice to meet Boy, these are some you. popular crafting tables. Don't worry, everyone. Your turn will come in time. Please have your materials ready when you approach the crafting table. Uh, I knew I shouldn't have waited so long to eat. This is a long line just to use a crafting table. You're telling me I'm so hungry I could practically eat my wheat right here. But I won't. I'll be patient and turn it into delicious bread instead. What, uh, what can I do for you? I'm so hungry. I heard you guys have an inn somewhere around here. Where is it? Oh, uh, Milo's place? <laughs> that guy's hilarious. He's over that away. Milo, huh? Thanks. No problem. How's it going? Huh, you know, still hungry, still waiting. Come on, come on, come on, come on. No building, no crafting, no brewing, no forging, unless with express permission from the founder. All complaints must be registered in person. That's it. You can stop writing now. Intense. Hey, Petra, what you looking at? Just admiring the sights, actually. This place is so cool. I'm not usually one for, like, checking out people's builds or whatever, but 
Even I have to admit, this is really impressive. The founder isn't accepting visitors right now. Captain Reginald, at your service. Hey, so what are you guys up to? Ah, just supervising this citizen while she does her build. The founder finally approved my petition. The founder? Well, that's her palace up there. She is the keeper of the Eversource. Builds everything you see. Some days I can't even fathom how she keeps it all straight. She's incredible. I'm a, <laughs> I'm a fan. She builds everything? Yeah, well, it sure is amazing. <laughs> That's why she gets to make the calls about what does or doesn't get built. Like my build. It's no easy feat to get all these oak blocks. Your petition was very well handled. Oh, gosh. That's nice of you. I just don't understand why everyone shouldn't be allowed to build. Ha! <laughs> what a sentiment. I mean, it is a good thought, but it's crazy. How's it going, Lucas? I'm okay. Just watching these guards. They really mean business. Yeah, I wouldn't mess with them if I were you. Can't believe they just built their way right into town. I, no, I've never seen anything like uh, it. Hello. Oh, oh my. Hello again. Can we uh do anything for you? You guys seem like you might have the scoop. What's up with the Eversource? Well, um, mm, well, it's, it's in the palace. Were you two talking about me just now? Um, no, no, uh, of course not. Uh-huh. Please don't hurt us. Can you two point me in the direction of the inn? They must be looking for Milo. Shh! Uh, I mean, no, 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 we don't know any Milo. Really? Because it sure sounds like you know him. Uh, okay, okay. We know of him. If you really want to find him... He's the kind of messy-looking guy. Spender's always falling down. So messy. Thanks, I guess. I'll just leave you guys alone, then. Have a nice day. Please stop building. It scares me. What? Nothing. We could have almost died just then. Oh, hush. Don't step on the grass, please. Okay. Sorry. I just take my job very seriously, because it is, in fact, serious business. Not many people get the honor of watching the tree, but... <laughs> I'm pretty good at my job. This garden must be special to get its own guard. What's the deal? The dirt here is precious. This garden feeds almost everybody in town. If even one block were to drop over the edge, whoo, catastrophe. signs point to that being the innkeeper like that sign and where should I put them yes just get them here I'll deal with them get out of here go go uh, why hello there what can I do for you I'm not sure what the custom is where you come from but uh, here <laughs> it is considered impolite to stare I heard from someone in town that you could help me other people were Talking about me? <laughs> they must have me mistaken with some other handsome innkeeper. <laughs> <clears throat> Out of curiosity, what is it that uh, they thought I could help you with? I'm sorry, but I'm actually quite busy. Inns don't keep themselves, you know. Lots of busy work. I heard you talk to the Blaze Rods earlier. What did they want? Hmm. Hmm. Blaze Rods? Hmm. I... I don't know any Blaze Rods. You must have been misled. I'm sorry, but it's like I told those other outsiders. I can't help you. Now, please. Hey, is this our guy? He tell you where to find the blaze rods? How many of you are there? I told you, I don't know anything. He hasn't told you anything yet? Is he hiding them somewhere? 
I am uncomfortable with this line of questioning. You sure keep saying I don't know anything a lot. Don't lie to me, Milo. That's how bad things happen. Fine. If it will make you leave me alone, that Aiden fellow did come talk to me earlier. Wanted to know where the Eversource was. Called it! I just told him what everyone else already knows. The Eversource is in the palace with the founder. That's all that happened, I swear. What a bunch of creeps. Yes, I wasn't terribly fond of them. So where is Aiden now? The group left for the palace, and I haven't seen them since. Attention! Attention, everyone! Just a moment of your time, please. Emergency meeting attendance is mandatory. Oh, slime blocks. Curious. I wonder what that's all about. Oh, it's the founder. I wonder what this is all about. Yes, I'm nervous being surrounded by so many people. Oh, this is not good. What are you... Oh, crap. People of Sky City, I'm sorry to pull you from your duties, but something urgent has come to my attention. A crime has been committed. A crime? What kind please, of crime? Please, please remain calm. Earlier today, outsiders built a bridge into our fair city from a distant island. know it or not, this is a violation of Sky City's most sacred law. No unauthorized building. Wait, is that you? Are you the bridge builders? Obscene the builders! Atrocious. Everyone, everyone, please. Yeah, I heard all about that stupid law, and it's stupid. A stupid law. Who would even come up with that? Jesse, wherever you are, Step forward now. I have already been informed of your identity. I appreciate that you may be ignorant of our laws, but I will warn you, Sky City is small, and I promise that if you try to hide, I will find you. We need to get to the Eversource at whatever cost. This is clearly our fastest way into the castle. By getting arrested? Wait! Don't be fooled by the Founder's lies. I can help you come up with a plan to get into the palace. Here I am! I built the bridge! Are you crazy? Does she look like she's gonna help us? Hey! Unhand me! Sorry, I, I'm going with Milo. Me too. Quick, then, follow me! Wait, wait! Hey, I'm coming hey, peacefully! That's them! They're getting away! After them! Jesse, run! Run! Oh. I think she's over there! 